Hey, go Link, it's a birthday. Go Link, it's a birthday. Go Link, it's a birthday. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, we have most helpful. Reggie, please, the man. <laughs> OB1 plays. Yes, right. What's up? All oh, right. OB1 plays. everybody how are y'all doing we have some amazing amazing nintendo switch news for this video but before we get started give the video a thumbs up let's get it over 300 likes do it right now let's go first news item koei tecmo the developers of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity are reporting that the game has sold over 3.5 million copies since the end of December, which is phenomenal. It hasn't been, it's been almost two months yet since the game has launched and the game has sold over 3.5 million copies making it the best selling game in the misu type um series now i haven't really been a fan of uh the um, the misu type games where you're just waves of enemies and you're attacking over and over but this game is the one exception i gave the first hyrule warriors Maybe about a 7 out of 10. <laughs> this one gets a 9 out of 10. Love this game from beginning to end. And the story. The story was, was great. And so, this is the official statement. In the Omega Force brand, Zelda Warriors, Yukasi is no revolution for Nintendo Switch, inherits the worldview of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild by Nintendo. By the end of December, the total number of units shipped exceeded 3.5 million, the highest number for a single title in the Musu series. And so, already in just two months, it's already broke the records for the best musu type game again it's the where's waves of endless warriors your um, enemies and you're outnumbered fighting this game is the best selling in the series and i'd like to say the name zelda might have had something to do with it nintendo you have a zelda ip of course it doesn't say zelda in the title but you got link you got zelda you got all the champions you got ganon all of that on a nintendo console it's bound to sell and this continues the trend of ips that launch on the switch breaking records the nintendo switch is a runaway train that just cannot be stopped right now and so good to see good to see i'm glad the game sold well well deserved they took time and care you could tell the story is just quality, quality, quality stuff. And I'm glad I did beat this game. I'm glad I went back and beat it. Dope, dope, dope news. The next news item. And this had my ears perked up. Tekken producer, the producer of the Tekken games, says he wants to work on a Pokken tournament too. However, it's on Nintendo to make it happen. On his official Twitter, Katsuhiro Harada. <laughs> I butchered that name. Uh, this is what he said, um, speaking of the Pokemon series. We have a good relationship with Nintendo and Pokemon Company. And Pokemon has had a great response. So I would like to make it again. But it's not what we decide. It's what they decide. And so, he said, the ball's in Nintendo's court. Just imagine another Pokemon tournament game with all new Pokemon fighters. Hey, my, bro, I need to get on some Pokemon tournament. Pokemon tournament was lit. 
tonight after Mario Kart. I'm gonna see if any sponsors. I'm gonna be playing Mario Kart with the sponsors, but I wanna see if anybody has Pokemon Tournament. Let's get some Pokemon action in on my gaming channel. Obi Wan plays gaming championship, but Pokemon Tournament is a solid, solid fighting game. Love the game on my Wii U. I think I double dipped on the Switch too. And so, Pokemon Tournament, Pokemon 2, could it happen? The Tekken producers want to make it happen. It's on Nintendo to make it happen. And I am here for it. Again, this is one of those games that launched on the Wii U. But because the Wii U didn't sell, it got a Switch port. Launch, it came out the launch year of the Switch. Pokemon Tournament DX. Solid, solid game. Included more um, Pokemon fighters. Um, Decidueye. We had um, Empyreon, of, of, I forget the Pokemon's name, yeah, I know how I roll with Pokemon, but the game is lit. Alright, next news item. This one is potentially a big one. Platinum Games is teasing a fifth announcement um, scheduled for 2021. Now... They already um, been saying that they're going to have major announcements throughout the year. The first one was Wonderful 101 Remastered. The second one was Project GG. Third one was Platinum Games Tokyo. Um, the fourth one was actually an April Fool's Day joke um, between Platinum Games and Hamster Corporation. And so who knows what this fifth announcement will be. You want to know what I want it to be? Give us actual a gameplay trailer, a Bayonetta 3, and a launch date. Oh, the internet would go crazy. This is one of my most... Metroid Prime 4 is the most anticipated game for the Switch. But Bayonetta 3 is up there. I love Bayonetta 2 on the Wii U. Fantastic game. The action was great. The combat was great. But all we got from Bayonetta 3 was this tease right here. Just a small tease. We need some Bayonetta 3 news this year. I don't think 2021 can go by without Bayonetta 3 news or even Metroid Prime 4 news. Even a tease, the concept, the direction where it's going. I know Metroid Prime 4 isn't launching this year. But give us something. Re I mean, Retro Studios is working on it. Come on, man. They're the prime goats. All right. Next news item. I thought this was interesting. Nintendo has ranked third for TV advertising impressions for January 2021. However, they're number one in sales. But um, they came behind out. The company that had the most TV spots, commercial spots, was Sony by a mile. Sony took up 44% of the market, um, video game market, when it came to advertising. Second place, Nintendo and Xbox sort of tied. Um, Xbox was 17%, Nintendo was 16.6%. But I think Nintendo is like, we don't really need to emphasize commercials too much. Switch is selling by word of mouth. People go, this is what's so great about the Switch. It's portable, and so the system really sells itself. You go out and you're playing, dude, like, what's that? What up? Why do they have these neon colors? What's that? Oh, it's a Switch, bro. Check out these old Nintendo games. Check out these new Zelda games. And you can just put it in your dock and play at home. And so... Whatever Nintendo's doing, it's working. It's working. It is working. All right. Next news item. Ladies and gentlemen, check this out. There is another major eShop sale going on right now. And some crazy, crazy good deals. Two things that's two games that stood out to me. Panzer Dragoon Remake six dollars and 24 cents do yourself a favor go download the game a old school sega genesis i mean not sega genesis uh, this is on the um not the sega saturn it's, sega had so many back-to-back -back consoles bro i think this was the saturn was it the saturn yeah i think this was on the saturn panzer dragoon um dope 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 game this was a sort of a Star Fox wannabe game. I'm gonna get it for six dollars twenty-four cents. I haven't, I never bought it, but 
Come on, bro. It went from $25. That's what it launched at to now it's $6.24 with the sale. And another notable price point, Resident Evil 4 for $14.99. So go check out eShop sale going on right now. Some cool, cool games are at a bargain price right now for the Switch. All right, dudes. What do you guys think about everything we talked about in the video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out, boy. You still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I got to hook you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on YouTube. Two, follow me on Twitter at Obi1Plays. And that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait. There's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash obi1plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later. Peace.